to me, this picture is pure freedom. The classic Harley-Davidson motorcycle, the empty American desert, and the two riders with seemingly no agenda. Even their postures give off a sense of liberation and easy riding. The driver confidently navigating one-handed, the other sitting with legs up and arms outstretched. It's like they don't have a care in the world. And that weekend, they didn't. Hi, my name is Monica Samet June. I am a professional photographer and I live in San Francisco, California. The photo was taken somewhere near Joshua Tree National Park in October 2014. I went to Babes Ride Out on an assignment for La Motocyclette, a magazine about women motorcycle riders based out of Brooklyn, New York. Babes Ride Out is an annual female-only motorcycle campout that takes place in Joshua Tree, California every October. The idea behind the desert adventure was born when two friends from Los Angeles recognized a growing number of female riders on Instagram. So they rallied their viral bike tribe together. And now, only three years in, the event attracts over 500 free-spirited bike lovers from all over North America. There's a great spirit of camaraderie and support among the women there. Um, it's also pretty cool to be um, at a women's only event. It's actually not like you're at a knitting club or at a book club. It's all filled with badass, fearless ladies. And one of those badass, fearless ladies actually helped her get the shot. I asked someone to let me ride doubles with her so I can shoot action photos of the girls riding in a pack. And this is how this photo came into being. I was holding onto her waist with one hand and I was holding my DSLR with a 24 to 70 zoom lens in the other hand and shooting. The women gather in Joshua Tree National Park for the low deserts, open roads, and high heat, cruising down an often empty highway in their crop tops and cutoffs at over 60 miles per hour, nothing but the sound of their mufflers and the 100 degree wind at their backs. The rideout's only rules, respect everyone and no boys. You have to be there to really understand the pull and spirituality of being in such an open, eerie place. The sky is so intensely blue, the air is warm, the roads are great for riding. Overall, you get the feeling of freedom. It's what I wanted to capture in my images. And it's why a place like Joshua Tree serves as the perfect backdrop for it. The Mars-like sandbox sits in the middle of nowhere. It's a quiet and mysterious place, made up of trails carved mostly by people who want to make their own path. People like bikers and off-roaders, wanderlusters and ramblers. A destination properly intended for the women of Babe's Rideout. I get claustrophobic and build a lot of anxiety if I stay too long in the city. You could say that nature is my church, my meditation, my anti-anxiety medication my way of connecting with um, spiritual power. For more videos like this, please subscribe. This Happened Here is new to Seeker Stories, and subscribing is the best way to never miss a new one. Thanks for watching.